7 Facts About the Giant Isopod, A Sea Lice That Looks Like an Alien The largest isopod is the giant isopod, Bathonomus giganteus, which is a type of crustacean. Giant isopods are actual animals, despite the fact that they might look like aliens from science fiction films. They reside in the water, a sizable region that is yet shrouded in mystery. At least the enigma surrounding the enormous isopod has been cleared up. Here are 7 interesting facts about huge isopods. Unexpectedly, the huge isopod is related to and resembles the Armadillidiidae, a family of organisms that is frequently encountered in daily life. Even though pill bugs are actually terrestrial crustaceans, they are sometimes confused for insects. 2 reside at the ocean's bottom. Bottom dwellers, or living organisms that reside on the bottom of the water, include giant isopods. They can be found living as deep as 2140 meters, dark bathypelagic zone, to 170 meters, dark sublittoral zone. Mud or clay floors make good hiding spots and shelters for giant isopods. The majority of the world's oceans are home to these animals that resemble pill bugs. The Pacific Ocean is another place you can find them. 3. The huge size of the giant isopod is the result of the deep water gigantism phenomena. The enormous isopod was unusually large when compared to its close friends, the pill bugs. A creature with the scientific name Bathonomus giganteus often has a length between 19 and 36 centimeters. However, a 76.2 cm long isopod has been discovered. What causes this to occur? Deep sea gigantism provides the solution. The tendency for deep sea organisms to develop to significantly bigger sizes than their cousins who reside in shallow seas is known as deep sea gigantism or deep sea gigantism. The majority of invertebrates, or animals without backbones, are affected by this phenomena. The reason for the size discrepancy is yet unknown. The vast size of animals may be an adaptation for them to withstand the extreme pressure of the deep water, according to researchers. Along with isopods, the giant squid, Archituthus tux, and the Japanese spider crab, Macrochira camphorae, also go through this. 4. The main course is carcass. A predatory crustacean that consumes carrion the enormous isopod. This is because there isn't much food in the deep water. They consume anything that dropping from the ocean's shallower regions, including dead fish, squid, and whales. These crustaceans are thought to be able to consume slow-moving creatures as well as carrion, like sea cucumbers, holothoroidea. The enormous isopod impaled, tore, and dismembered victims with the help of its intricate mouth parts. They will also bite people, albeit the wound they leave behind is not very big. These sea lice have a lengthy lifespan without food. Before passing away in 2014, one enormous isopod in Japan went without food for 5 years and 43 days. 5. Roll into a ball when in danger. Animals that ball up when threatened include pangolins, falodota, Brazilian three-shouldered armadillos, Taliputes trisinctus, and pill bugs. The big isopod curled up to protect the delicate bottom of its body, much like these three creatures did. In addition to providing refuge, this system also protects food from being stolen by other animals. Imaginative, yes? 6. Do you have any traits with cats? Who would have imagined that among all the creatures that inhabit the planet, isopods would resemble cats, feel as catus. These two creatures' eyes are identical, which is why they are similar. The tapetum lucidum is a layer found behind the eyes of giant and feline isopods. This layer amplifies light by reflecting it back through the retina. The capacity for nighttime vision. The eyes of giant isopods and cats similarly appear to shine when exposed to tapetum lucidum. The huge isopod employs both sets of antennae to sense its surroundings, which may help them see better at night. 7. People can consume isopods. 
don't shock yourself just yet. It stands to reason that if humans are capable of and interested in eating puffer fish, deteradonity, they will likewise be interested in eating isopods. Isopod foods were once available to eat in Yokohama Chinatown. In contrast to the enormous isopod, this isopod is not very huge in size. Bathinomus totalani is the scientific name for this isopod, and it tastes like crab or shrimp. To make a meal of fried rice, Hiroyuki Tarada has been attempting to transform a mass of isopod. According to Gizmodo, isopods are also consumed as crackers, however these are no longer shrimp crackers. The cost per box reaches 1,620 yen, or 212,000 Indonesian rupees. Interested? What do you think after learning more about huge isopods?